so the limit angle mate is also used to uh, lock the rotation of a component um, between the certain angles uh, specified by the uh, user so let me show you uh, first of all let me delete this limit distance then uh, also delete this parallel and let me delete this plate now if um, I have to rotate this part now if I click this uh, only line not this face only this line press and hold control key then select this line release the control key and then select coincident also select uh, this face and this face make them coincident or parallel now um, let me fix this plate then uh, here you can see um, if I try to rotate the selected component is fully defined because we had also created the coincident mate of this face with the uh, the face uh, bottom face of this uh, component so we have to delete it so click on this component and then select view mates then we have to delete this coincident mate now you can rotate it now you can see um, uh, this part is uh, rotating 360 degree um, and now I'm going to um, uh, log the rotation of this component along with this uh, with respect to this face uh, let's say 30 degree minimum and uh, maximum uh, let's say uh, 75 so for that again click on mate option here then scroll down advanced mates and from here limit angle mate select it so this is the maximum angle this is the minimum angle and uh, so select the uh, desired faces this face and this face and type here maximum uh, minimum distance uh, let's say 15 degree and maximum um, 75 degree then press ok button again press ok button now you can see uh, 75 is the maximum and minimum 15 degree so now we are able to um, uh, make the rotation of this component uh, fixed on this part so this was uh, the limit angle mate and uh, you can also add it, uh, edit it by clicking on this limit angle one and then edit feature now um, 